This book is um, a labor of love, and um, it's primarily a book of images and quotes. Uh, most of the images are from Asia, Southeast Asia, Japan, Korea, Taiwan, um, as well as Vietnam, Thailand, Cambodia, Laos, oh, not Laos, and Burma. So um, what I've done is paired images inspired by Kuan Yin, uh, the goddess of compassion in the Buddhist tradition, with quotes by women teachers from the time of the Buddha to the present day. And um, we actually have one of those teachers in our audience tonight. So I want to start here, let's see if I can do this quickly, with a quote by Sandy Boucher. Sandy Boucher wrote the foreword for this book, and she's the author of Discovering Kuan Yin and many other books on feminism and Buddhism. And she starts with this quote, within every civilization there is a yearning for the divine feminine. Within every civilization there is a yearning for the divine feminine. She goes on to say, we want to see our spiritual guides embodied not just in the iconic male representations, but in female form. Now, a lot of people say to me, particularly Buddhists, say, well, doesn't that, um, doesn't that, that has nothing to do with gender, right? Well, I love her answer, and this is what I'd love to say next time somebody asks me. No matter how many times we are told that enlightenment transcends gender, and I'm sure it does, Still, we are left with all the gender differences and inequities that operate in our daily lives, whether we are men or women. And so we hunger to see femaleness mirrored in the figures that inspire us. How many of you hunger for that? <laughs> okay.